Greetings everybody, Blackshot here, welcome back to another episode of Arma 3 and finally after I don't know how much time uh, I'm finally playing the Contact DLC as in I'm playing the campaign and after dealing with that uh, I'm gonna be putting Arma 3 uh, away for a little bit probably for a year or two or maybe three so just let it rest uh, allow various content creators to create more missions and campaigns that I can enjoy. And yeah. Contact! Contact! Alabama's hot! Livonian forces have the road south of the objective! Our APC is gone! We're taking fire! Acknowledge, Child Light 2 1. Push through to the factory and link up with Amber. Cash is already inbound. ETA 1 Mike, out. Alright. So, let us begin. I hope. It will be it will be a fun fun campaign. Not canonical in the official timeline because there are no uh, there are no uh, like aliens uh, officially. So and I also hope because this is made by Bohemian Interactive that this actually will be, will be a very solid campaign. Child Light 2 1. Push through to the factory and link up with Amber. Cash is already inbound. ETA 1 Mike, out. Rudwell. Rudwell! Time to move. Where's Jack? I don't know. He went to relieve Baker on point. LT! Still! You still in this? Alright, fuck it! On me, let's go!
Hey, you run. You mind? My arm. It's kind of aching over here. Keep that jammer on it, Jack. What is this? Yeah, I tried that. Service panel stuck. You wedged a fucking screwdriver in it? Yeah, like I said, I tried that. It's stuck. There's an operator control station in the guardhouse. You can turn it off there, right? Okay. Stop. Edit. Parameters. Simulation, false. And execute. Howlite 4-1 to Howlite Actual. Livonian Defense Force UGVs are out of action. I reckon I could pull some intel if you can wait one. Over. <laughs> Great. You bluebells get extra points if you shoot us in the back? Hey, what the hell? There, American. I shoot you front. Yeah, thanks. I appreciate it, pal. Alchemist to all call signs. Index. Howl light. Impressive work out there. I've never seen such a clusterfuck. You can run the gauntlet again this afternoon. Maybe the reserves can show you how it's done. Further to my left. Transfers. If we hadn't had the pleasure, see me at the talk. Out. You catch that, Rudwell? Report in. Tactical Operations Center. That's the green container, with an asshole outside. You the new blood? Yes, sir. Specialist Aiden Rudwell. I've just been reassigned on a PCS. Then you are my problem. Wonderful. Do you have a map? Uh, just a sketchbook, sir. Not enough maps to go around. Sinews of war, huh? Rip that one off the whiteboard here. Okay, so let's take a look at this. Our joint exercises span the Nadbor region. As you know, that's pretty much one big military training area. No civ pop to give us any trouble. But this, this is premium strategic real estate, the Andreev Gap. Take ground here, and you close the door on the Baltic states. Anyway, our boys are pushing east from the Kaliningrad border. Obviously, in this scenario, role-playing as the Russians. That means we'll be facing off against the Livonian Defense Force. Already this morning, we've put some pressure on their MSR here. Later today, they'll counterattack dominating the high ground south of our position. To simulate this, we're doing a lot of live fire on this hill. Ah, uh, perfect. That's this country, pissing on our fireworks. I shit you not, even the weather here's against us. Listen, let's wrap it up. Point out anything you want to know. Ah, Polana. The LDF have a small logistic staging area at the junction there. It's only home to a few MTA wardens now. Everybody else left. Seems we don't make good neighbors. Shopka 41. Let me guess. An old Soviet site? Mmm. Radar base. LDF test their drones there. Camp Conrad. That an FOB, sir? It is. And right on the edge of our live fire zone. That there? That's a Black Goopsville. One of our many burn pits. Piss me off and I guarantee you'll see more of it. That a military tower? Kind of. Armed Forces Radio. It only airs your lieutenant's pick of classical music. If I were the colonel, I'd make that a tier one priority target. That's the Livonian Defense Forces MOB. Aside from being their main base of operations here, it's also the home of the elite 5th Regiment. Special Forces. 
You'll spot them by the wolf's head insignia on their sleeves. Nadbor. You know if that's a large town, sir? Large enough. Just don't expect a warm reception. People there, they've had enough of army folk. This road, it's not part of the training area? No, civilian corridor. It's the only way through to Nadbor if you haven't got a pass. All right, then. Let's get this shit show on the road. See that concrete office across the courtyard? I need you to go on over and assist your slack-ass corporal. I need that electronic warfare demo making sense. All teams for Razunian firing range. Assemble at the embarkation point. Drużyny udające się do strzelnicy w Radoninie. Zbiórka w punktach załadunkowych. Runwell, Corporal Stipe's up on the roof if you're looking for him. Fucking way. You here for a 101? <sighs> Homewood's orders. I got voluntold. The Don? So what are you, like idiot proofing? Hey, I didn't want to be here, Jack. Ah, whatever. Better you than some damn bluebell. Jammer's on the desk. Let's get you zapping shit. Now, what you've got there is some funky fresh tech. A modular electromagnetic spectrum device with an integrated analyzer. Oh, that's catchy. Yeah, which is why us Sparkies call it a Spectrum or M-Spec device. Ah, here we go, my faithful assistant, Monsieur de la Dartaire. That UAV on a program? I don't know, it's doing stuff, ain't it? Okay, so, point the antenna at him, hold it, and wait for the signal to scan. You ought to get a confirmation beep. See those bars lighting up on your display? That's his signal strength. You can use those readings to get a rough location of the source. First lesson's tracking. Hit him up over to the right, and again, scan that signal. This is simple electronic support. Identifying electromagnetic emissions to map a battlefield. Yeah, think blindfold chess. Mine is a blindfold. Okay, nice. Ah, something else. You don't need a visual in order to receive radio waves. See if you can find them. Yep, there you go. Moving on. Electronic protection. Huh. I'm not sure he's coming back. Is the geofence on? Nah, he's good, he's good. He knows where he's going. Take a look at your device. You got full bars? Nope. Exactly. The hill's attenuating the signal. And this part of the demo I go on about terrain, how it affects high, very high, and ultra-high frequencies, yada yada, you know all this. Yeah. Show me how you jam stuff. Electronic attack. The third and final pillar of electronic warfare. I was building up to that.
If you aim at our little friend and squeeze the trigger... Ah, okay. He's setting down. Telemetry's out. Yeah. The noise you're transmitting breaks the connection. Autopilot takes over. He thinks he's out of range. Specialist Rudwell, Lieutenant Kingsley, you got a minute? I need a sanity check up at Point Dakota, over? Uh, yeah, um, <clears throat> affirmative. North or South Dakota, sir. You mean there's more than one? Look, once you're done dicking around on that roof over there with Stipe, I'd like an assist. Out. Hmm, I better see what's up. He actually sounded kind of pissed. Well, nicely timed. I gotta verify some numbers for the live fire, and well, all I'm getting is a false negative. Maybe a dud designator. Could be, but only the GPS is out. Huh. Do you mind if I take a look at it? Yeah, no, not at all. Be my guest. There's a load of concrete targets. On the hilltop to the south. Should be marked with purple smoke. Okay, I got them. Coordinates are zero, six, seven... <laughs> yeah, it's glitching. Magic touch? <laughs> you know it. Okay, can you give it another shot? Zero six eight zero one five. Confirmed. Great job. Really? Hold here a sec, I'll call it in. Alchemist, Howlite Actual, requesting cast support on zero six eight zero one five. Over. Message received, Howlite. Stand by. The Great Hawks vectoring for approach. Out. Give it a few secs. Payload's a GPS guided smart bomb. You're not going to want to miss this. You ever seen one of those things go boom before? Yeah. Right. Drone operator. You sign up for that? Not really. I enlisted as a translator. Six languages and an extra G every month. Then, it all went digital. Anyhow, long story short, helped my kid put together a mini-bot last Christmas and figured, hey, Army can have me doing drones. Pointless to fight the future, huh? Okay. There he is. You got him? Yeah. Uh, <laughs> he's missed it. Overshot the target by what? Half a click? No. Oh my god. All call signs. Incoming on the factory. No play. No play. Code echo. I say again. Code echo. Jesus Christ. Rudwell, get down there. Find out if there's any casualties. How am I, Alchemist? Report your status. Roger that. 
that. Wait what? Not all of us are accounted for. Alchemist to Amber, RTB. Blue on blue, code Echo. Copy, we're coming back. Situation unclear, more to oh, follow. Oh, fuck. Lieutenant, it's bad. Medivac. One of Out. ours, wounded. Two others, non-responsive. Uh, six, maybe seven, LDF, all dead. Advise, over. Get a med kit, do what you can. Private Dillon, stretcher. Corporal Snipe. Move that APC off those cobbles. We need more space for a helo. I didn't see no. shit. Over. Lieutenant, do you copy? I read you. I got eyes on a dust off. Fuck! Just wait where you are. Over. It moved! That thing just fucking moved, Red! was interesting very interesting hey Ben Don wants you. Over in the comms tent. Yep. Thanks, Dill. Hey, Rudders. You see the news yet? No. Why? <laughs> You're almost famous.
Rudwell, LDF just put the boot in. They went all this fritzed in 48 hours. 48 fucking hours. Never mind our permits for the roads aren't valid yet. Or, or, or the fact that the NMCCs are all choked. No, oh, ah. The Blue Hells want us gone. Cancel the exercises by all means. But this, this is suicide by logistics. I swear if the Russians invade, it couldn't be too fucking soon. Listen, it's all hands on deck. Even the colonel's out there, hitting corners. I need everyone to do the same. Not a problem, sir. He didn't let me finish. I need everyone, including that slack-ass corporal. Corporal Stipe. I love that I don't have to explain myself to you, specialist. But then I guess that's what makes you so special. He's on task, carting our little shit over to the burn pit. And sorry to say, I want you to tag along. Stop him from getting on the business end of an MP's nightstick. Roger that. Things are tense enough as it is. The Livonian Defense Force have the accident area locked down. You know why? I just got the word. Highly toxic vapors. In addition to structural instability, that factory is sitting on a landfill of chemical crap. Methyl isocyanate. Apparently it's really fucky stuff. LDF began evacuating Nodbor this morning, and the radius of effects only getting bigger. So, PPE will be mandatory from zero hundred hours. Oh, sir? Uh, Norad's on the line here. Patch it through to the LC's office, would you, Keats? In the meantime, you're hauling ass. There's a loaded hammock over by the main gate. Hey. Major wants me with you. What? Are you his stoolie now? Okay, fine. I gotta ask a little favor first. The fuck you will, Jack. Last one I did for you got me NJP'd. <laughs> yeah. Could you just swing by the armory? Pick up my M-Spec device? I'd go myself, but, you know, reasons. I thought we were on a garbage run. Sure. But there's something I gotta do on route. Baker. Corporal Stipe wants his doohickey. Right. Spectrum device? There's one in the back of the Faraday cage. Nice improv in here. You still expecting World War III? Always, man. Doomsday clock. It's one minute two. I don't know. Russia joining up with CSAT? I mean, yeah. Being trading partners is one thing, but... Full-on membership? That's quite a commitment. And it's not working out so well for Belarus now, is it? I'm driving then. I'd say that's a reasonable assumption. You gonna give me directions or just be a prick all night? Directions? Oh, you really have been living the high life, haven't you, Rudd? Doesn't know how to get to the good old Black Goopsville. Follow the road, princess. <laughs> you mean the smell? Ah, there we go. That's the spirit. So, what's this thing you gotta do? About that. Whoa! Okay. I get it, I get it. We can shut up and you can drive faster. It's not through the roadblock.
right, I am sometimes not getting the the names. Ah, I'm driving then. I'd say that's a reasonable assumption. You're gonna give me directions or just be a prick all night? Directions? Oh, you really have been living the high life, haven't you, Rudd? Doesn't know how to get to the good old Black Goopsville. Follow the road, princess. Whoa! You're gonna smash into shit, you may as well let me drive. You mean the smell? Ah, there we go. That's the spirit. Whoa! Okay, I get it, I get it. We can shut up and you can drive faster. Right. Oh, it's not through the roadblock. Okay, top of the hill. Pull over at the layby. You want to tell me what we're doing? Hasn't anything struck you as kind of strange lately? Yeah. Life is strange. What's your point? My point? You hear that shit about a chemical leak? Yeah. You hear we got 48 hours to get our asses stateside? Yeah. Because I'm hearing everything. Because it's all out there, tingling on the airwaves, Rudd. You don't believe me? Try the spectrum device. You see the transmitter tower? Focus the triangular antenna at it. And, uh, switch to detail mode. On your screen, you got wavy lines. Waves, Jack. Yeah. Our electromagnetic sea. Now, in with those, there's a peak. That indicates activity. There's also a vertical bar. Slide that over to the signal while you're aiming at the source. Music. Huh. It's modulating the signal, too. That's not all. The LDF? They're using pretty basic encryption. Scramblers? Yeah, poor bastards. Hard as nails, dumb as planks. You cracked the comsec. In a way. I swiped a couple grams of modafinil from the medic supplies at Point Hopi, and exchanged it with a militia nut for the price of a genuine bluebell radio and its crypto key. Oh, Christ. Okay, so, go ahead. There ought to be some chatter, bouncing between whatever's going on at the factory and the burn pit, a short ways up the road. Oh, and yeah, don't forget to adjust the vertical frequency band. Otherwise, all you'll get is static. Sierżancie, pamiętaj, za twoim punktem kontrolnym obowiązuje użycie ostrej amunicji. Nie pozwól nikomu się oddalać bez odbioru. You used to be a translator, right? You get any of that? They're not talking about an industrial disaster, are they? You think this is a cover-up? I asked around about the factory. There was never any landfill there. The Soviets built it on top of an old sawmill. And as for that thing we saw in the sinkhole, I, I got nothing. You hear that? Sounds like a helo. Moving target. Try and catch him as he comes over. Do bazy. Masz do przetransportowania ważny ładunek. Wynuję zadanie. Jestem na wektorze podejściowym. Bez odbioru. Nicely done. I guess you're going somewhere with this. I need a wingman. No. No, what you need's a fall guy. You are the fall guy, Rudd. The blue on blue. The loss of face. The protests. The politics. If the DOD can't pin it all on Russia, who you think they're gonna come to next? 
The LT or the pissed off linguist? Last seen on that day on a roof with a fucking drone jammer. Yeah, I was with you, jackass. Or did you forget? No, I didn't forget. Drive us to the burn pit. And don't sweat it, I got a plan. Jesus, that stench! Bet you can feel it coating up your lungs already, huh? Well, you got a choice. It's either step out of the cab and we shovel shit, or... I run you through the plan, which I may add does not involve sucking in the sweet stuff. Okay. You in? Depends. You gonna get me killed? Not if you don't do anything stupid, I won't. Look, we're right next to the LDF's restricted zone. I'll distract the guards while you get near the factory. I made a load of notes on your map. Infill, exfill, plus a vantage point. Did you jimmy my footlocker to do that? <laughs> yeah. Fuck you very much. Yo, you're welcome. Soon as we hop out, beeline for the corner wall. There's a break which leads down into a gully. Uh, what's a gully? Six languages, and you don't know what a gully is. I'm disappointed. Alright, so come on, let's do this. Hey, free bet. Just cool. Yeah. Remind me why I'm doing this? Cause you didn't want to play in Dookie. Or end up in prison. You probably speak Russian, right? I'm not a sleeper agent. No. I know. Just... Don't shoot anyone. The Bluebells may be dicks, but uh... They're fighting for the good guys. <laughs> the world really is up black and white for you. What? Never mind. Careful as you go down, and... If you got it on... Watch out for the flashlight on your spectrum device. I'm gonna shake things up a little. 